Bonita Palp. Hello everyone. My name is Miss Evans and today is St David's Day, the patron saint of Wales. And it's the 1st of March and we celebrate this every year. I'm Welsh, that means I come from Wales, I was born in Wales. And so I'm going to tell you a little bit about St David's Day today. So who is St David? He is the patron saint of Wales and he performed miracles. He talked all about Jesus, all the stories about him to lots of people when he travelled and he was able to help his old teacher be able to see again because he was blind and it was a miracle. On this day, on St David's Day, Welsh people wear Welsh dresses, mainly children and they look a little bit like this and the girls will wear this with a hat on top as well and this dress has a daffodil on and you might see a lot of people wearing daffodils on St David's Day you'll see me wearing one that's for sure and then sometimes people dress up in the parades as dragons because we have a dragon on our flag and we also have one on our rugby balls because we are famous for rugby in Wales and I'm a bit biased but we're the best. So rugby, that's what we play. We're not so keen on football or not very good but that's what we like to play rugby and we wear a daffodil and I'll tell you why because our national emblem is actually a leek but the Welsh name for a leek is Ken Hinnan. And that gets confused with the Welsh name of a daffodil, which is Ken Hinen Bedder. So that always gets mixed up. So now we have a leek and a daffodil. So that's a little fun fact for you all. So now I'm sure you all want to practice your Welsh. And I'm going to sing a little song that you all know, but it's in Welsh. And it's called Heads, Shoulders, Knees and Toes. Have you ever sung that song before? I'm sure you have. So listen carefully because I'm actually going to sing it in Welsh. Okay, so it starts like this. Pen a squid I coys I tried, coys I tried. Pen a squid I coys I tried, coys I tried. A true win. So guys, clash I a hag. Pen a squid I coys I tried, coys I tried. So that was the head, shoulders, knees and toes. And I'm going to give you another fact now. The longest named village actually comes from Wales. And it sounds like this is actually where I am from. This is where I was born. And it goes like this. It's the longest name. And I want you to see if you can try and copy me after I've said it. So it goes like this. Yes. That's a real place. It's where I'm from. It's a tiny little village with a tiny little platform that has the full village name going all across it. And I'll say it one more time for you. And I want you to see if you can send me a voice note or a video back of you saying it or having a go at least. So it goes like this. So have a go to see if you can do that. So that's everything. I'm going to say a big goodbye. Hulvaur, Palp, Hulvaur. And I want you to send me in all the facts that you've learned about St. David's Day into the responses, any activities that we send you in the link. I want you to have a go at them or even just trying to say a few phrases in Welsh. And the main one, St. David's Day, Dear Gould, Day with Sant. Bye.